Hello my friends and welcome back to our continue blind let's play Homestuck for the PC. My name is the Flightless Bird, this is your story based gaming channel and today we cross over the 4000th page, 4086, where there's a lot of stuff going on so let's jump into it shall we? I hope you all having a wonderful, fantastic day today, as we uh, just got done with the five times ultimate combo showdown, and our buddy here is going hog with blood everywhere. Carcat trying to reassure. Shh. Pat. Pat. Shh. Hog. Looks like he's about to eat his finger. Pat. 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 Honk. Honk, 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 honk. Shh. Ooh, Kark. It's almost like the scene from The Avengers, uh, Age of Ultron, where Natasha Romanoff is trying to calm down the Hulk. Honk. Honk! Pop, 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 pop. Shh. Aww, they hugged. So cute. Unlocked album, Cospit and Durs. Okay, there's no panels for me to click on, by the way. Pale Mates for Life. That picture, that's so cool. Now we got AH over here. The, uh, person. And the Night of Blood so embraced the Bard of Rage. And in each other's arms, they were a quiver. And with righteous pap and blessed shush, he did quell his brother's fury. For the knight looked upon his bard, all acting up and completely losing his stuff, and he did resolve to calm it, his juggalo butt right the heck down. And so calmed down his juggalo butt was, and would continue it to be for all time. And the knight, in totally settling a murderous clown's ludicrous stuff down proper, said, Let there be more allegiance. And it was so. And between more rails would flow bounteous mirth. And they did hug bump it plentifully, and honks of reconciliation echoed far and wide, true into the darkness upon the face of the deep. Close the tome. And it was good. It was almost like playing like God here. Hmm? Put the book down. Recap four. <laughs> the last recap I wrote was that really big one in the white ink, and Jade had just bumped popped her dead dream self into Beck Sprite for prototyping. The Jack Sprite flopped out and destroyed the columns supporting the laboratory and the big bell toll and bounced off the house and bowled down the snowy hill and started crying and ah, screw this. Click the panels. There's only one panel to click. Yeah, there's only one panel to click. Get them all up there. Carcinogenesis became trolling garden gnostic. Uh, Jade. Uh, the password is, uh, see you soon. Okay, uh, I'm gonna go take your lack of responses, tack and verification. Also, this pretty much has to be the last conversation we have, right? I mean, your timeline cuts out completely in a minute or two because of the scratch. What are you looking at up there? Are you hypnotized by the flashy stuff? What the heck? It's been going on ever since John started scratching that big gosh darn record. Aren't you acclimated to it by now? Hello? Harley, Giga's mother is screaming. Ah, whatever. I've stuff to do now. I guess I should be keeping an eye on the sky too now that I think about it. The bright green beacon should be appearing any minute. Assuming you actually managed to blow up the sun. And then? Well then, I guess we will get to all hang out. Well, maybe also not being an unyielding mortal peril. It's getting kind of old, frankly. Okay, well, this is a pretty uh, horrible farewell. But I guess I'll have to do it since there's some serious show-stopping stuff transpiring up there in stupid outer space. Well, later, Jade. I'm gonna go make sure John knows what the heck he's supposed to be doing. And in case none of this works, we don't actually get to meet. I guess I should say, eh, uh, since apparently my gutless future self can't express himself and never got around to saying so. That is leaving it up to me as usual. To say, uh, that, uh... 
Oh, sorry. I was distracted. Oh. No, not all by the scratchy stuff in the sky. There's something else coming down. What? Ball. It's hard to make out, but I think it might be. What? Shaving cream? Is it John? Just cut out. What the heck is shaving cream? It's like. Pursuit Genesis is trolling, grind Gnostic. Hey. Huh? Car cat? Oh, what's with these arrows? These arrows. Oh, no, it's not John. One of our friends. Is he our friend? Don't know. But he dropped a ton of shaving cream down upon everyone. The heck? Boom. No, they both going into the magma. I know Ciso changing too. Dead. No, Jade! He blew her up. You're not my friend at all. You rat bastard. Dropped all the shaving cream down and then blew it up and created an explosion that blew Jade to kingdom come. Arr. Cascade. Oh, everything like just changed. The end of Act Five. Play. Hold them. Oh, that's cool.
What are you waiting for? Draw spades. Oh, it's the fourth wall.
Well, dang, I mean, where do I even begin with that? Jeez. First of all, that was almost like watching a... Watching a cartoon. Um, it, it was long. It had the most epic soundtrack ever. It had great art. It had great designs. It had just so much happening at once that I, I need to go back and rewatch this like three or four times. Because I don't even know where to begin on that one. It's just... That was incredible. Absolutely incredible. And I know that those like Sunfire Jr. and uh, Entrail Will will feed me some more info of things that I can look forward to when I watch this whole thing back again. Uh, because, dang, it's so much that happened there. It, it looked like... It, it, it looked like Jade died and then resurrected as God tier, but she was wearing, if I'm not mistaken, AH's signal, uh, symbol. So I, I sh wow, just, that was great. That was amazing. The music was amazing. The, the cinematic was amazing. The way it expanded the screen was amazing. Um, 1025. What does that mean? End of Act 5. Unlock the album Homestuck Volume 8 and unlock page Tumblr. More q and with Andrew Hussey, uh, commentary on Cascade, and more. Uh, interesting fun facts about SKK can be read by clicking here. So, Cascade came out on October 25th, uh, 1025, 2011. Okay, that's why it says 1025. Homestuck started on April 13th, 413, 2009. Act 5 started on June 12, 612, 2010. During the events of Cascade, the humans and trolls physically meet for the first time. 413 plus 612 equals 1025. Huh. Very cool numerations. Cascade came out 500 days after the start of Act 5. 500 days is 1 year, 4 months, and 13 days, which is 413. Cascade came out 925 days after the start of Homestuck. 925 is 2 years, 6 months. 12 days? How in the world did he do that? That's insane. Up until this moment, Homestuck was constantly getting updates. Each update added a few pages, usually in between 5 and 12. These updates happen daily, often even multiple times a day. Generally speaking, you could never run out of Homestuck. This was the first time Homestuck went on a hiatus. The last update before Cascade came out happened 49 days before. This was an unprecedented way didn't wait period at that time. The time of the next update was known. Readers are exactly one to return to the site. And at that time, MSPA was getting millions of visits every day. During Act 5, MSPA was constantly getting more visitors than CNN? Dang. It's obvious to Hussey that this might that this many people come to the site out at once would crash it. So he made a deal with Newgrounds, who hosted the video for him. Now Newgrounds was the biggest site for flash games and videos at the time. They were used to million users all at once. They were sure they, were sure they could handle the Homestuck fan base. And they were wrong. <laughs> all the dots. News crowd crashed in a matter of minutes. Luckily, some readers got the whole video on load before the server went down and decided to stream it to Livestream.com because Twitch didn't exist yet. And Livestream.com went down. Plus, they updated the upload of the Flash video a Mega Upload and Mega Upload went down. Someone used a screen recorder to record the whole Flash video as a video and uploaded it to Dropbox. Dropbox didn't go down entirely, but they temporarily blocked that file from being downloaded because it was generating so much traffic that they were scared of it crashing the server. Someone who was lucky enough to download the video for Dropbox uploaded YouTube, and you guessed it, YouTube went down. Oh my god. People on Tumblr and Twitter would complain about not being able to watch Cascade. A lot of amp posts was made. The sheer number of unhappy posters crashed Tumblr and Twitter. Yes, two websites that even had the video went down as well. Took four days for the situation to calm down, and many people didn't get to watch Cascade until day four. That's insane. That is absolutely insane. Animation two. Good oh lord. English. Has he arrived? Well, he's always been here, right? Some way or another. Import universe to you. Authorization you. Execute this dot die.
Creepy. Why is it saying honk? Is it more terrifying than our other friend? Enter answer two. Please go here for Vex, Duodecum, and Jealous. So Vex is king. Uh, Duodecum is 12. And Angelus, I think, is Angel. So King Angel the 12th. Ru du Duodecum and Jealous is a family video about total tolls finding the Black King at the end of their session. It's approximately eight minutes long and took years to make. It's considered one of the most family projects. Also, it could be almost considered official because some of the people working on it were also working on Homestuck pages. Ideally, you should watch on YouTube because the creators deserve your view. Don't worry, it opens inside the collection so you don't need to change your recording sessions. Pick it out, for example, because you're offline or because your video got taken out of the future, the whole video is archived here. Oh, hi to the face. Oh, you done messed up now.
took his head off. The end. They ain't over yet! That was amazing. Oh my God. That was absolutely ridiculous. Good Lord. That was incredible. And jeez, I, I, I'm, I'll try to make sure I have their video link in my description below. So you can all go over there and give them a like if you haven't already. Amazing. Do I start Act 6 now? I feel like with all that's happened, even though this is a smaller episode compared to my other episodes, I feel like I should probably stop here because it's just so much that has happened. I, I need I, I need to go back and watch that other video a few times too. So yes, this will be a shorter episode than normal. Sorry about that. Uh, but I hope you guys have a wonderful, fantastic, amazing, awesome day. Thank you to everyone. You are the number one YouTube community on all YouTube. Thank you to the, uh, uh, what was their name, by the way? Uh, Rex Duodecim Angelus. Uh, thank you for their video project talking about playing the Black King. It is absolutely incredible and amazing and just, yeah, it was amazing. Uh, so, yeah, I, I love you guys all very much. I will talk to you again very soon. And until next time, so long and take care. Thank you for watching this video. Feel free to comment on what you saw and what you'd like to see next. I always love to hear your thoughts. But before we go, please remember that you matter and you are brilliant and you are loved and you should always be true to yourself. Never let the world tell you any different. Much love to you from your friendly, feathered, flightless bird.